Toyota hybrid models, which are becoming more and more popular among Canadians every year, are now available with two different types of hybrid battery. Depending on model, those two battery types used in Toyota Hybrid Synergy Drive systems are called Nickel Metal Hydride and Lithium Ion, based on the different elements within their structure. Both battery types are rechargeable and perform the same function, which is to store electrical energy in the vehicle and release it to the vehicle's electric motor, or motors, as needed to drive the wheels. Nickel Metal Hydride type batteries have been used in Toyota Hybrid since the introduction of the first Prius in Japan in 1997, with numerous changes and improvements to their design and performance along the way. Significant among those improvements are increased energy densities, which allow today's battery packs to be smaller and lighter for a given energy output. Lithium-ion type batteries are now widely familiar for their use in small electronic devices, such as smartphones. They have even greater energy density than nickel-metal hydride type batteries, which enables even more efficient packaging, taking up less space and weight in the vehicle. The batteries may be recharged by the gasoline engine or through regenerative braking. In plug-in hybrid models, they may also be recharged from the electric grid while stationary. The battery state of charge at any time can be monitored on one or more graphic displays within the vehicle. The state of charge is automatically controlled by the hybrid system to optimize efficiency, so it may not reach the highest possible level indicated. This does not indicate a malfunction. The onboard computer ensures the hybrid battery never discharges completely, it maintains an optimum state of charge for extended battery life and to ensure the battery maintains sufficient energy storage capacity throughout its life. Frequent use of EV, electric vehicle mode, has no adverse effect on battery life. Under normal use, the hybrid battery is designed to last the life of the vehicle. While both battery types are maintenance-free, they do generate heat when being charged or discharged and are, therefore, fitted with their own cooling systems. If the vent becomes blocked, the hybrid battery may overheat, leading to a reduction in battery output. It is important to always keep this vent clear from obstruction. Extreme weather has an effect on all vehicles. The lower the temperature, the longer it takes to reach operating temperature. The higher the temperature, the greater the reliance on the vehicle's cooling components. The features and functions described in this video might not be applicable to your Toyota model. See your owner's manual for details. Thanks for watching this Know Your Toyota video.